Good afternoon, my YouTubers. This is Daniel Dresky 4 for your guide for the updated video on March 14, 2021. Today is the first official day of the daylight savings. That means it gets light out there more often. Yep. And these are the VHS tapes I got a f I got from this past week in my in the Pottsville Library in Pennsylvania. I live in Pennsylvania anyway, and I got all those 137 VHS tapes. Some of it might double, might be double featured. That means double length for like two or for about three, four hour movie or something. Yep. So let's begin with some tapes I just have. Okay. The first VHS I have I'll be keeping for myself is the 1965's Born Free, 1966 winner of a two Academy Awards including the best score. Yep, Bill, T Bill Travers is in there. Yeah, and Gregory King. Originally, Born Free came out on VHS back in 1979. And it was reissued in early 1983. And this is the 1984 reissue. Yep. And there is a sequel to Born Free, like Living Free. Sorry about the label, but I will fix it eventually. 1984 sticker label. This could be this could be from 1985 when they put it on VHS Hi-Fi. Print date was on April 9, 1987, and, he, and this is an ex-library tape. This tape was printed it on the 8th week of 1987. This is a worthwhile to find copy of Born Free on VHS, and here it is. Now, the ones for eBay selling, I may have to put it on the other side. The ones I'm keeping goes on that side. Yep. Now for eBay, I'll be selling. I already have Back to the Future has Michael J. Fox. This is an early 1986 original. This has stereo, I mean, Scotch EXG, an extra high grade hi fi video. 1986, early 86 release from MCA Home Video. I checked the tape out and they, and they, had, and they cut out the uh, deaf tone in there from, from, from my library down the block. This tape has got to be made in the spring of 86. MCA home video release. Mm -hmm. Now here's something for myself I'll be keeping. Ralphie. Ralphie is the one who sings like children's songs. I prefer Larry Gross. This is on VHS from... Um, From, Tr from Treble Border Records, 1984 VHS, mm -hmm. featuring some songs like Down by the Bay, Baba Black Sheep, Wheels on the Bus, Baby Balula, He Got the, ho the Whole World, The More We Get Together, and many more songs. It's only a 45-minute video. This has got to be an 84 or 86 print. Never can tell. Then I'll be definitely keeping that. Sorry about the little tape damage, but I will fix it in the future. The next tape we have here, something I showed you from my, one of my previous update videos, uh, the original Peppy Longstocking. Now I had to sell the reprint one. I got it from from my Goodwill thrift store in um, at the Casona Mall about five months ago in October. And this is the this is the 1986 reissue of Peppy Longstocking from Hollywood Video Gems. Originally came out in the in the big fat box or the clamshell in the early 80s. I had to get this copy. This is a little hard to find. All these tapes I got were 25 cents a piece. I'll show you what the, the tape looks like, the original sticker label. I used to rent out this copy of Peppy Longstocking when I was at 150 Northern Boulevard during the uh, mid-2000s or the late 2000s. Yep, it's not the same about those video stores anymore. I'm definitely keeping that. Here's another, the fourth tape we have here is 
Jocko Have I Love. This is some kind of like a, one of the PBS specials. Stars with Bridget, uh, Bridget Fonda and Jane, Jenny Robertson. 1989 release from Public Media Video. And it's a Wonder World family movie series. Definitely going to keep that, but I might keep that for the time being. Because I like these original PBS specials. Mar Here it is. Mary Kate and Ashley's... Um a uh, sleepover party. That's part of the Mary Kate and Ashley's uh, "You're Invited" series. That was released from Dell Dell Star Video in 1995. Um, release, and I'm not going to keep this. I'll be selling the whole tire Mary Mar Mary Kate and Ashley tapes. Cover the print date on it. It's not that important because this is not mine. Here's another one I'll be selling for eBay. A fairy tale theater's Hansel and Gretel with the young Ricky Schroeder and Joan Collins. I already have the 1984 release in the fairy tale theater big fat bo uh, in those big box series from CBS Fox Video. However, this is the 1987 reissue of it from Playhouse Video. At the end of this tape has a preview of the fairy tale theater collection promo. Yeah. We're not going to keep this. Mm hmm. I'll be selling it. Here's another Mary Kate and Ashley. Adventures of Mary Kate and Ashley, like the case of the Christmas caper. Yep. And this is the 1995 release. I'm not really into Mary Kate and Ashley. Show you what the tape looks like. Mm-hmm. I'm not a Mary Kate and Ashley fan, but I bought them anyway to sell them. Here's a Disney VHS tape called Boo Busters. There's got to be a 1994 release. That's the first volume of the series. When they have one of the uh, episodes on there, like Halloween, Halloweenies, Ghosts of a Chance. That's a Chippendale Rescue Rangers episode. On also comes with another two volumes. We're in this collection, like Monster Bash and Wish Rule. This tape has got to be printed in 94 from Walt Disney Home Video. On this tape has the Dark Green Duck collection promo and the, uh, and, the Goof, and the Goof Troop collection promo. And here's the Barney tape. It's called I Love to Read with Barney. This has got to be uh, the, the, the promotional thing for just for JCPenney. I'm not really into Barney, but this is like a promotional tape for, like, the public library. 1993 release. Here's another tape. We have Willie and the Squirrel. Willie and the Squirrel was made in 1989, and this is on VHS in 1993. That was released from... Paramore Films, that's the, the home video distributor. And I'll be keeping that for, for myself for like a little while. Vertical sticker label? Mm-hmm. An ex-library tape. Oh, crap. Hold on. Now, here's Random House Home Video release of Arthur's Eyes. Comes with Francine's Bare Hairdo. Hair Day. And I know I used to have one of the Arthur VHS tapes. And this is released in the spring of 1997 from Random House Home Video. I used to have this on VHS. I used to have, like, um, Arthur's Pet Business, Arthur Writes a Story, Arthur's Baby, Arthur's Lost Library Book, and Arthur and the Real Mr. Ratburn. And Arthur's Computer Trouble and Arthur's Birthday. Yep, I'm definitely going to sell that. Now I got here, like, one of the Easter specials, like Easter's Around the Corner. Here's Here Comes Peter Cottontail, narrated by Danny Kaye and voices of Vincent Price. 
in in this in the future I'm gonna show you on my other video channels like of my Danny K VHS collection. And this is the 1990 release from Family Home Entertainment. And this was recorded on the EP format. Here's the ink label. Yep, and here comes the print date. Printed it on... 37 week of 1994. And also on this tape has the East, Easter Titles uh, promo from Family Home Entertainment. Now the next one I have, I'll be selling, something I used to have, the Mark Train Classic of Life in Mississippi. It was a 1984 release from MCA Home Video. I used to have other Mark Train tapes like uh, Adventures of Huckleberry Finn. That was a 1985 TV special. And this TV special was in 1980. And it has the Mark Train Collection promo at the end of this tape. The Life of Mississippi, someone must have teared this up. That's not me. I used to have that on VHS to have water damage when I was in New York. Now here comes the next tape. It's called Bob the Builder, The Knights of Fix Fix a Lot. Mm -hmm. This is the feature length video that was released in nineteen. That was released in two thousand three. One of one of the VHS tapes di dying hours. Yep, came. It was made in the yellow tape. That was released it from HIT Entertainment. Yep, and I'm not gonna keep that. I'll be probably selling it. Next one we got here is an action movie. It stars with Harrison Ford and Ransom Hearts. It was made in 19. It was made in 2000. I think it was in 99, and this is on VHS in 2000 from Columbia TriStar Home Video. Same time it was out on DVD. And this tape was printed it on the 8th week of 2003. That was going to be around, around by March. The last, the last of like the Homer Milwaukee that stars with with Dan Daniel Day Lewis it was made in 1991 from 20th Century Fox I think it was in 92 this is on VHS in 1993 release from Fox video here's what this tape looks like mm-hmm and here comes this uh, print date was printed it on the seventh week of 1993 and I'm not gonna keep this I'll be selling it Here's a movie with, with Clean Eastwood. I don't mean Dirty Harry. Is Dirty Harry in the in the Deadpool? It was made in 1988 from Warner Brothers. Lum Nielsen's in it. The one from Schindler's List. This is the 80, 1989 release from Warner Home Video. I don't know that this tape tape has the um, death tone at the end. They stopped doing the death tones in 1989. Go ahead, punk. Make my day. I'll be keeping that for myself. The next one I have here is Star, Star of Echo. That starts with Kevin Bacon. It was made in 1999. It was released on VHS in 2000 from Artisan and Entertainment. Same time it was out on DVD. I only like Kevin Bacon in Animal House and Footloose in one of his early days of his career. This is printed it on the 31st week of 2000. Mm -hmm. That was when they started to have Artisan Ant DVD titles. Here's a movie that stars with Gene Hackman in Mississippi Burning. That was made in 1988 from Orion Pictures release, and this is on VHS from 1989 from Orion Home Video. Mm -hmm. It has the ink label, and it doesn't have no previews on there. I have one of the other Orion Home Video titles, that is um, Monkey Shines I do have. And something that starts with Nick Nolte, and, and colors, I'll be selling that soon for, for eBay. There's the Perfect Storm stores with George Clooney. Yep, 
George Clooney is not no related to Rosemary Clooney. Nope. Probably that's got to be her son. I don't know. And this is on VHS in 2000, released from Warner Home Video. And here comes the print date. It was printed it on on October 17, 2000. Here's one of the Stanley Kubrick's movies. I don't mean uh, Doctor Strange Love, but Orange Clock. Here's the Clock with Orange that shocked the whole world when this movie came out. Part of the Warner Home Videos. Uh, Stanley Kubrick's collection. This is made in 1971. Comes with a theatrical trailer of the film. I'm trying to find the early 80s original release. Has the ink label on them. Mm -hmm. The next one we have here that is The Rainmaker in Spanish that stars with um, that has Matt Dillon and Danny DeVito. And this movie it's not in English. It's got to be a Spanish VHS. From, from Paramount Viacom Company. And this is the 1998 release. And uh, this is printed it on... 22nd week of 1998. Here it is. Fearless, it starts with Jeff Bridges. Bo Bridges' younger brother and the son of Lloyd Bridges. Was made in 1993. It was released from Warner Home Video in 1994. Fearless scores. The Bridges is Marvel. Marvel, one of the 1993's ten best movies by Peter Travers, Rolling Stone. Let me see the print date. It was printed it on on July 5th, 1996. Here's K-Pox. K-Pox also stars with Jeff Bridges and Kevin Spacey. I saw a movie with Kevin Spacey with Richard Pryor and Gene Wilder and See No Evil, Hear No Evil and Glenn Gary, Glenn Ross with Albert Chino and Jack Lemmon. Something I, I must have rented out on VHS during the, like the last summer in Pottsville Library. In Pennsylvania. This is released on VHS in um, two. It was made 2001. It was released on VHS 2002. The same time it was out on DVD. And this and this tape was printed it on the eighth week of 2002. The next one we have here. Seven Academy Award in Novel included the best picture, the, the Insider, that has Russell Crowe and Al Pacino. Touchstone Home Video release. This has got to be released in, uh, got to be 1999 or something. This is printed it on October 3rd, 2000. This got to be in the widescreen edition. Next we got here is Piano. Holly Hunter and Harvey Cartel and Sam Neill. And this is a good movie and I'll be keeping that for myself for like a little while. I like Harvey Cartel when he was Mr. Wolf in Pulp Fiction and Mr. White in Reservoir Dogs. Directed by Quentin Tarantino. And this is made for Miramax in 1992. This is on VHS 1994 from Live Entertainment. When it's owned by the rights of family home entertainment. Mm -hmm. So the copy of Piano is... It's a 1994 release. Yep. This tape was printed it on the 15th week of 1995. At the time I was 10 years old. That's for myself. Now the next one we got here is the new guy. I don't know what that is. It seems like a a pretty wild comedy or something. And this was released in uh, in this is made in 2002. This is released from Columbia TriStar Home Entertainment in 2002. Same time it was out on DVD. That was when VHSs were fading out at the time. This is printed it on the 28th week of 2002. 
I turned, I was 17 going on to 18 at the time. Now here's one for, uh, I'm not going to keep. That stars with Tim Allen and, Ka and Christy Alley in The Richer or Poorer. That's a 19, um... 97 comedy. This is on VHS 1998 release from Universal Studios Home Video. And this tape, it's not from the United States. It's got to be from, from Canada. The Canadian copy. This got to be printed in 1998. We're not going to keep that. The, but, the, Brit, the Budget Jones Diary. It was made in 19... Um, got to be 1998 or 99... This is released for Miramax Home Entertainment. Let me see the print. It's got to be around the late 90s, early 2000s release. X Library Rental. Mm -hmm. The next one we have here on VHS is Parenthood. It's an all star cast comedy and drama with Steve Martin, Rick Moranis, Keanu Reeves. Jason Robots, Mary Steenburgen, and Diane West, the one from the Lost Boys. And this is the early 1990 release from MCA Home Video. At the time, it was changing the name to MCA Universal Home Video. And this copy, it's not exactly the original. This is a reprint from 1994 from MCA Universal Home Video Background in Blue. Printed it on the 19th week of 1994. I was only 9 years old at the time. Directed by, this movie was directed by uh, Ron Howard. He directed, he was a movie director and he was a child actor in The Music Man. Sorry about that, folks, because I had something to take care of for a second. The next movie we have here on VHS, The Witness of the Prosecution, that stars with Tyrone Power, Moridi Dietrich, and Charles Lawton. Based on the book by Agatha Christine, it was made in 1957 from United Artists. And this is the 1992 release, I'm trying to get the one on VHS, 1983. And the CBS Fox Video Dropbox Packaging. And this film was directed by Billy Wilder, director of Double Indemnity and Sunset Boulevard. And a Cameo Award winning Lost Weekend. Yeah. More tapes to give. Now I got less tapes to keep. To just to keep. Here's one of the best known holiday movies of all times, a public domain. Jimmy Stewart, Diana, Re Diane, Diane Reed in Frank Capra's masterpiece of It's a Wonderful Life. This is not a colorized version, this is the black and white version. I already have the black and white version on VHS 1981, and I got the colorized and black and white DVD from Paramount release in 2007. However, this is the 1985 release. From the Hal Roach Studios Award Movie Greats. Recorded it on ST. One of the tapes I showed you earlier from the Hal Roach Studios Award Movie Greats was the Laurel and Hardy's Music Box Helpmates. Stick a label. Mm -hmm. I gotta close this box. Boy, this whole collection's growing. Here it is, like the McGee and Me, not the not so great Escape, and this is the 1989 release. 
I don't have that that many like the McGee and Me tapes, but I found them by accident. One of the early weeks of living in Pennsylvania, that was before I had like the YouTube. Yep, doesn't say print date on it, mm-hmm. This is like an opposite to Random House. Or Golden Book. Here's a booklet about the the McGee and the McGee and Me series. Ideas and ideas for parent. I'll be keeping that. The next one we have here is Tell Me a Story by Michael Baldhair Williams. And it has some stories about like different stories. The Wicked John and Soap, Soap, Soap. And this is from Kansas Video Corporation, The Communications in 1986 release. I have the other one downstairs. The, I might have to think about just unsell it. It means I'm not going to keep it. I mean, I'm not going to sell it. I'll be keeping it. This is worth hard to find. One of the Kansas and one of the other Kansas Video Communications VHS tapes I have is one of the Peanuts specials I have. Oh, speaking about Peanuts, I have here it's Magic Charlie Brown with. I have here, it's Magic Charlie Brown, a 1988 reissue from High Tops Video, distributed by Media Home Entertainment. I already have it on the... Soon, I might get the original release of it's Magic Charlie Brown. Comes with Charlie Brown All-Stars in the 1984 VHS. This is Volume 9 of, of, of this series. For the High Tops ones. One of the High Tops VHS tapes I showed you from the other channel, that happens to be Dick Tracy Volume 1. Here's a workout tape called Kathy Smith's Body Basic. Yep. And this is the 1986 release from uh, from JCI Video. Mm -hmm. And this program was on full stereo. Show you what this cassette looks like. Mm -hmm. Looks like in great condition. I used to have the other tape like that, the one I got it from the thrift store in Jamaica. I had to sell it. Next tape we have here, it's back to selling it for eBay. The Reindeer Games, that starts with Ben Effick. And it's uh, like one of the good action movies ever made. This is on... Uh, this is on VHS, got to be in the late 90s and early 2000s. An ink label printed it on August 6, 2000. At the time, I turned 16 years old. Here's Crime uh, Crimson Tide. It stars with Denzel Washington and Gene Hackman. This is almost like The Hunt for Red October. And this was printed it on a to on run right on April 11, 1996. Maybe this tape has some previews on it, but I'm not going to take chances. Here is the Last Man Standing. Stars with the diehard actor Bruce Willis. New Line Cinema, New Line Home Video release from. Got to be from 1997, and this film was made in 1996. Amazing, out, out, outrageous. Yep, one of the most exciting movies of the year. This film co-stars with Christopher Walken and Bruce Duren. This tape has got to be made in 97, who knows. Now I got here Disney's Tom and Huck. That happens to be the uh, 1996 release from Walt Disney Home Video. I used to have that on VHS. Mm-hmm. Based on the book by like Mark Train. Here's another Mary Kate and Ashley VHS tape. Uh, Hawaii Beach Party. Mm-hmm. From Dell Star Video. 
And in Kid Vision, this is released in 1996. Mm-hmm. 